Hi, let's look at how to clone the Siri animation in Swift UI using the combination of 2D and 3D rotation. To follow along, I want to show you how to get the design asset. This is the Figma community. I'm going to search for Siri. The one that we will choose in this project is this one. When you download a copy, you can see all the individual layers, but I have already uploaded this to the Xcode assets library. So in this video, I will not show you how to bring the assets from Figma into Xcode. Luckily, I have a previous video that covers that. How to draw a clone of the Siri icon. You can also find the code on GitHub in this repository, Purposeful iOS Animations. If you click on this link, you get the code as a gist. This is the assets library in Xcode. So you can see I have all the individual layers or views uploaded to the library. I have all the individual views in this file and arrange them using ZStack. The views are more than 10. So in this ZStack, I have 10 of the views. I added another ZStack for the remaining view, which is this one, highlight. Before we create the animation, we need a state to store the initial and the final animation states. So here I have defined this state is rotating and set the initial state to false. Then we want this animation to trigger automatically. So at this point, I added the on appear modifier with this animation easing and duration. Then we bring the state variable and toggle the state. After doing this, you can use the state variable to animate the 2D rotation of each view. With some of the views, we will use 3D rotation to animate the Y and X coordinate. So let's start with the first view. You can see here, we have three images. The first one is the shadow. It is the one behind all the images. So with that one, we don't animate that. After that, we have another image, icon BG. We don't animate that as well. And the third image is this one, pink top. So here we animate that using 2D rotation with the state variable along with ternary conditional operation. So we evaluate the state variable and when the condition is true, we set the angle to 320. And when it is false, we set it to an angle of minus 360. You can see here, we have that view animating with 2D rotation. Using the same state variable, we also animate the hue rotation. So as the object is rotating, its color also changes. The next view is pink left. This has the same animation for rotation and hue rotation. But here we change the rotation angle. For example, the first one, the true value is positive. But here we have the true value as negative. We also change the hue rotation angles. For the next image, blue middle, we do the same thing. We have 2D rotation. And then here we added 3D rotation. So we set the angle of rotation to 75. And here we have the X axis, which is rotating. So with some of the views, we use only 2D rotation. And with others, we use the combination of 2D and 3D rotation, like this one. In the next, we have 2D rotation, hue rotation, and 3D rotation. For the previous 3D rotation, we animate the X coordinate. But here we are animating the Z coordinate. So we can repeat this for all the other fields by using 2D and 3D rotation and changing the angle and the coordinates at which the views rotate. In this example, we are animating the Y coordinate instead of the X as shown previously. So this was done for all the views in no particular order.
If you like, you can also animate the blend mode. And with this, we will end here. So this is how to clone a Siri animation in Swift UI using 2D and 3D rotation. Thanks for watching.